The demonstrators took to the streets today in Waukesha. They took part in a peaceful march. Mary Jo Ola was there as demonstrators and police found common ground. Hey guys, yeah, this protest lasted more than four hours and ended here at the Waukesha Police Department. Throughout the whole demonstration, we saw moments of strong emotions and mutual respect and support between law enforcement and marchers. I can't breathe! From downtown Waukesha. Everything since that first day when we were brought here, this is what this has caused. It's been a buildup of everything. I'm a teacher and sometimes I get worried about sharing my perspective, but... You know, I have an African-American son, and I think it's important that white people are out here supporting the cause, showing solidarity. To the courthouse, major streets, and the neighborhoods, a group of at least 100 protesters carrying signs called for justice for George Floyd, who died in Minneapolis police custody. People on the sidelines watched, some cheering them on. Some businesses closed up shop for the day in fear of potential vandalism, but organizers say a peaceful protest was a priority. Waukesha police and sheriff's deputies blocked off traffic, but they didn't stop there. A few times, Waukesha law enforcement showed their support, kneeling and shaking hands with protesters. I know there's things we need to do to treat people better. Everything comes from, from both sides. We all got to try to work together. At the end of the day, we out here breaking our backs just like they out here breaking their backs too. You give them a mean to protest and get our message across. And the fact that they really, they really took the time to knee down shows that they care. We need more officers around the streets like that. Now, as a protest wrapped up here, Waukesha police expressed their thanks to demonstrators for keeping a peaceful demonstration. This comes after officers in Waukesha spent last night assisting Milwaukee police. In Waukesha, Mary Joola, TMJ4 News.